yesterday, I asked you if you could send an emergency message to everyone in the world, what would it be? Here are your most urgent answers. She is talking to 10 other guys. Move on. Aw. Uh, erm, um, some fellas and ladies need to hear this. Whoever is reading this, I hope you can become rich and successful. I haven't seen that in years. Thank you, spooky pizza slut. Very cool. Hello. The simulation will be shutting down on May 2nd, 2026. This is your only warning. I honestly, this is how cults are started. You just created a tax exempt religion and are well on your way to becoming a multi-billionaire. This is actually a smart text. This is a good text. <laughs> Am I the asshole for sending out a national emergency ping for no reason? <laughs> I, 50 male, wanted to have fun, so I sent out a wireless national emergency alert. Not the asshole. I would have done the same thing, and I'm not even 50. If we had that power, we would abuse it. Not the asshole. Uh, upboats to the left. This. Let's play eight ball. Guys, what if we turn billiards into a battle royale? Wait, hear me out. What if we did a giant table? The table is too big and there are way too many pool balls and it's everyone's turn at once. Wait, that sounds chaotic and fun. I would play that. Someone craft that. Someone make that. Oh God. Great suggestion, Iceland real, even though I don't believe in your country. Hey, uh, <laughs> hey, uh, I think you forgot to, <laughs> think you forgot to reply to my message. <laughs> Anyways, what's you up to, baby girl? <laughs> it's fine, you don't have to respond. <laughs> uh, just thinking about you. <laughs> Aaron and I nightly and daily tell each other like, God damn, I'm so glad we're not like dating in this day and age. Tinder looks like a dystopian nightmare. Flirting in the DMs also sounds and looks horrible. Don't miss my dating days. A photo of Jeff Bezos credit card with the caption, <laughs> felt like giving back. What an epic sauce gentle sir. <laughs> Do they have those three cool numbers on the back though? Cause if you don't have those, no sale. You ever see those websites that like try to spell out the disgusting wealth of, of, of the Bezoses and Musks of the world? Some website that's like, it's basically just a long bar chart and it just shows like a millionaire's savings and worth versus, you know, Bezos's worth. And it's just, it's terrifying. If you have megalophobia, definitely don't check that website out. Cause holy, pardon my French, Guacamole. Oh, f you. It's you are now breathing manually. F you. This works. This works on me every time. I first saw someone use this in a green text like 10 years ago. Oh, man. It's a good thing I'm too dumb to like, you know, let that affect me. You know, my IQ is in the double digits on a good day. So I'm, I'm fine. I'll bet this would kill some people. If you don't send this to 10 other people, a girl with no mouth and no nose will visit you at 3 a.m and ask you to join her MLM. It's true, you guys. This actually happened to me. This is my whole generation. The girls no nose and no whatever popping out of your closet if you don't forward this email. This defined my entire generation. Back when you had to forward emails. I just talked about this in a recent yai, but you know, that was the shit I had to deal with growing up. Hi, colon three. That's all. Your mother and I have decided to go our separate ways. That's a great idea to just mass send to all 7 billion people on the planet. Statistically, some percentage of that is expecting that text. Let's be real, this threat was just bubbling under the surface anyways. Maybe a text like this is a good thing. Now it's just out in the open. Just a great text, actually. Alert everybody that they can now get emergency alert system premium for $20 a month and everybody who doesn't will now get advertisements before, during, and after emergency alerts. It's like YouTube. Once you get emergency alert premium, you can't go back. You can't go back to the uh, the ad-friendly version. This is from hashtag everyone is feeble. No lies detected, sweaty. <laughs> okay. If you're reading this alert, you are one of just 10,000 lucky people who will get an iPhone 15 Pro for just $2. I'm Mr. Beast, and I'm doing the world's largest iPhone 15 giveaway click the link below to claim yours now still waiting on mine by the way don't know who i sent those two dollars to but gosh darn it was just so convincing it was so real so so excited for ai to get to that point where we just can't tell what's real anymore very excited for that uh totally non hellish landscape when politicians start uh flossing and saying things like sus and you don't know if it's real or not quibble cop is starting something epic sauce all right we're all gonna have ai avatars that fake 
fake gameplay or whatever, or provide zero insight commentary to uh, stolen TikToks. Can't freaking wait. I'm excited for an AI Mr. Beast to start spewing alt-right rhetoric and people will go, yeah, I always knew he was based. Uh, gotta put on shades. The future looks so bright. Does this look serious? Followed by a picture of an infection on my body. You're gonna get a lot of good feedback. Statistically, some percentage of those have to be skin doctors, epidoctors. That's the medical term. And they're gonna take a look at that rash or whatever and go, hmm, looks pretty serious. And then you'll also get a thousand replies saying, I don't know, I just WebMD'd it and it says you should amputate it and you have three hours left to live. A message like, device will explode in 10, 9, 8, with beeps that get louder and louder every second. That sounds a little too advanced. No offense, I don't think you have the technological prowess to, to do. This would never work, world's dumb. Your answer was so bad and unrealistic. Look what your answer did. Your answer made me dumber, even more so than I am already. Family guy is canceled. <laughs> real oh no <laughs> i got excited because when i read the beginning of this i i thought it would just be like something pertaining to family guy funny moments which i would also like to text the world funniest cleveland quotes cleveland sus <laughs> but you went a different route and said family guy is cancel this is a great way to get family guy trending in nanoseconds and then people will do like r.i.p montages and black and white of like you know the funniest brian moments there are no funny brian moments because every brian moment is just a uh, piece or I'm an atheist. But there will be a lot of epic Stewie compilations that day. Just the fog is coming in Zalgo text. That's cute. Is that the new thing now? Are we memeing about the impending fog? Because I saw something on Know Your Meme the other day, and that's, by the way, that's how I get all my news, both meme worthy and actual news. And someone made a reference to the fog's coming, laughing, crying face. I like ambiguous references to an incoming, inevitable, ominous fog. I'm very cool with that meme. That's a good May May. Better than E. I always hated the E meme. I'm okay with incoming fog memes bring them on i say anyone down for furry fun tonight hit me up wee -woo, wee -woo. <laughs> please bring back the giant emoji copy pastas do you know what i'm talking about yeah dick summer dick summer yes 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 like it's dick summer and you know what that means it's holiday season so that's what this answer reminds me of those glorious december copy pastas it's just as funny usually copy pastas you know they wear off right i still love december and i'm very excited for it emergency message can we be friends mm, i don't see why not um i know i don't know each other that well but i like your vibe random 7.8 billion strangers i sent this to it's giving parasocial mm. to be fair making friends truly does get harder as you get older it's true college is the easiest especially if you live on campus you live in the dorms everyone's just like you know a knock away but when you move out to the real world it's tough making friends this is my unsolicited nobody asked for it real take and real talk on this joke answer sorry gamers that's the truth i'm a truth teller i don't spin no yarns all right i tell it how it is wow that was a ramble and a half holy shit due to the unforeseen weather we will unfortunately have to delay the nationwide gooning session <laughs> we will <laughs> we will provide an updated schedule as soon as possible it's my hope and my dream that we can put all of our differences aside and just take part <laughs> and i can't even say it i can't even say it it's just it's so foul and yet <laughs> oh no change the world my final message goodbye We're just referencing all these old maymays that I think never outstayed their welcomes. I really like that. To be fair, there are worse things you could mass send the world. Tell everyone to change the world. Some people will. Are you part of the 1% that actually will change the world? Sweaty. <laughs> Ew. God damn it. This one starts with hi kitten. Hi kitten. Followed by a fuck wrong numbers sorry no own it don't back down be the chad and and continue why kitten you've been an awfully naughty pussy <laughs> perchance you'd like to go out with a lion such as myself mm, kitten <laughs> All right, nationwide emergency alerts that you would text to everyone if you could. Can we just appreciate how, how much effort he puts into his videos? Love this comment. You know it's typed in by real people, real people and not bots. And it's real every time. And they always get a ton of likes because it's real and not like paid for. And honestly, can we just appreciate how much effort this answer has? Thank you. <clears throat> Wealth, fame, power. 
Gold Roger, King of the Pirates. Oh, is this a One Piece reference? Is this like the opening to One Piece? That show all you weebs like? Yeah, I love One Piece. I've definitely seen all 1,000 episodes. I might pull some weeb shit and watch One Piece on um, Netflix. I, I, well, at least the Netflix one is digestible. If I, if I started with the anime... Guys, that's hundreds of fucking episodes, literally. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm aware that there's like a certain order that you can go to like, you know, not have to watch all 1,000 episodes that are currently out for the anime. But... Chip, what do you think? Should we watch One Piece tonight? Where's my where's my fluffy pupper doggo? Oh, she died. Oh well. Oh god. <laughs> the council just sent a scroll of just of, of toilet humor answers. Like farted, farted, sharted. Who farted? I sharted. Need a pee. Farted. Oh, that's awesome. Not the not the answers themselves. Just the mere collection of this data really makes me uh, shart my darts. I like that. Well done, council. One of the ways to make toilet humor funny is to just curate it and, and compile it into a single way too long PNG file. This is good. This is good content. Yeah, hello. This is an emergency. Ooh, please do not panic. Kidding. I like the cat emoji. <laughs> I think he's cool. Yeah, that's one way to make um, the entire global population hate you. There's not a lot of things the world can agree on, but this is an exception. No one would stick up for you and say, wait a minute, they got a point. No, not a single solitary yeah. soul would defend you after sending that to the world. Whatever punishment you receive is just, and I hope it's slow. What's up, y'all? It's God. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have a program for the Earth to self-destruct in about 30. See y'all in a bit. Can you make me disappear? Can you cross this all? This would make all the atheists go, Damn it, Brian from Family Guy lied to me. I thought he was right. Turns out there is a god. And Sweaty, he's tech savvy. Hey, girly, go and buy them. <laughs> no, no, go and buy them baby shoes. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, oh no, while wow, they are on sale, because that baby, <laughs> no, just had a super sad death, and never wore them, <laughs> not for sale, girly, oh, I'm like lightheaded, because I didn't know where that was going, and it just got better and worse the more I read that, how did I not see this at the absolute apex of the baby shoes joke era? This one I feel like is three or four years too late, and yet it's so good. I don't want to spam it, though, because it's so pure and perfect. <laughs> Fantastic. I'm in the awe of what might be one of the best Yai answers ever. Quick, text this video to everyone you know. Don't give them context so that they can all go, who is this balding man? Why is he yelling at me? Why is he wearing a headset? He's not even gaming. Send this video to everyone you know. Now, quickly, do it, pussy. No balls. You won't. <laughs> Send it now before a girl with no eyes, no nose, and no ears pops out of your 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 closet and calls you cringe. Do it now. She called me cringe, and I'll never recover. I don't know why, but YouTube really thinks you'll like this video. Probably because of the full frontal nudity. Click it!